What is going on guys? It is Fatal Reaper Day bringing you guys another video. We are on the HP Pavilion with the Oculus uh, Quest 2 or Meta Quest 2. Basically essentially the same thing. It is a VR headset nevertheless. In this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to play VR on your HP Pavilion. First things first, make sure you download the Oculus app. Um, it does connect all of your account information as well as your any games you've had previously or if you've had a, a you know VR headset before. I personally actually got the Oculus when it first came out, sold it, and then now I've got a MetaQuest. That being said, again, make sure you download the Oculus app. And then next thing on Steam, you want to make sure you have Steam VR. Very important. Make sure you update uh, or download the driver for Steam VR and you download the actual application Steam VR. That will allow you to then, when you're connected, and you can connect wirelessly. So on the MetaQuest 2, you can connect wirelessly as long as your computer uh, or with a cord, as you can see here. I do have it connected with a cord. I do per I do prefer corded connection when I'm playing on a laptop or a PC or a game like that. I do not really care for the wireless. I've noticed the wireless tends to lag on some games. That being said, you can you know you can do that on your personal preference if you want to play wireless or uh, you know with cord. But do make sure you download Steam VR, and uh, again, you can only play wirelessly if you have something with a Bluetooth like a laptop. But again, the USB-C port is on the left of the HP Pavilions, and then you'll be able to play. In this, I'm going to be showing you guys the, the gameplay for the forest. So we are now on the forest, which does offer VR off of Steam. Again, uh, you can either you know buy your games from the MetaQuest Store or Oculus Store, or whatever you want to call it. And or you can play off of Steam and other games like this. So Steam it does offer some games than VR like Skyrim, The Forest, and as well as other ones. Um, so The Forest was the easiest thing I could load up to kind of show you. The, this is a recording from the laptop. I do have the VR headset on at the moment when I was recording this video. Just to kind of show you guys gameplay and everything. I do not have an FPS counter. But uh, last, last time I ever played VR on... Um, it's been a long time ago, but I did actually play on the HP Pavilion when I first got the Oculus. But like I said, I sold it before I started doing a lot of YouTube videos, so I didn't really have a chance to make them. And I have been asked the question many times, can the Oculus play uh, on the, the V, uh, or can a VR headset, be, can you play it on a HP Pavilion? So the answer is yes, you can play the VR headsets, Oculus or MetaQuest, um, whatever you may have, on the HP Pavilion. So all you have to do is plug up with the USB-C port, make sure you download the Oculus app to link it, um, make sure you of course have an account and all that, and make sure that you do download Steam VR. Very important if you want to play Steam games, make sure you download Steam VR, or you won't be able to play it correctly. Other than that, that will connect and let you play. Um, I didn't run into much lag. Like I said, when I played wirelessly, I did get some lag here and there. But for the most part, when I was playing um, wired connection, it did seem to be a lot more stable. So I do recommend you plugging up directly with the USB-C and then plugging it directly up to your Oculus or VR headset. That being said though, guys, I had no issues playing it. So again, the HP Pavilion can do even more than just play a lot of your game popular titles. It can play a VR headset, so if you're looking to get a MetaQuest or the Oculus, and you're wanting to play some VR games, you can definitely do that with your HP Pavilion, uh, with Steam and other, uh, you know, if you, with Steam VR and all that, you can play games like that. So if you're looking to do it, it is a go. It does, in fact, work. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any more questions, let me know down in the comments below. I'm going to be doing some more videos on the MetaQuest 2 here. Uh, Resident Evil 4 is now on here, which was one of, one of the biggest reasons I got it. I will be doing some videos on Resident Evil 4 and playing some gameplay. That being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to like and subscribe as always. And leave some comments down below for what if you want to see or any issues you guys may be having. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.